Hello everyone and greetings from Nanawal country. I am Mukta Sapkota, a senior high logistics with water. I'm excited to say that we have recently released Music X 1.4 and Music 6.4 to streamline the conversion of Music 6 models to Music X. In this video, I'll walk you through the steps for file conversion so can you smoothly transition your projects to the latest version. So let's get started. And for that, first of all, let me share my screen. So now I can share my screen. So for uh, to begin like your conversion process, what you need to do is you need to first of all, open uh, the file, music six file you want to open, which are SQJ format file. So let me open these files. I can, I already have my music 6.4 open here. So I'll go and open this file. So I'll go and click here and then open from here. So I have created two examples actually. One is a normal music, music X file with normal climate template file. And I'm going to open both of them. And I also have prepared another example here, which is a music link example. So once I have this file open, first what I need to do is I need to convert both files into MEF format, then which I can bring that into my music EX. So let me first of all start the conversion process. So to convert your music 6.5, file, what you need to do is first of all within your music 6.4, once you open your required file that needs conversion, you go to this create model tab under create model tab there is this import and export option so you can export that file as an mef file so let me click on that and then you just give name here so i'm just saving on the same one here so music six example so giving the same name here and save it so you can see now this is exporting this file. This not only export the overall model setup, but also export climate configuration. And if there is any SQS curve, or if there are any nodes associated with the different source nodes and treatment devices. You can see now once this export process is finished, it gives you a message, project exported successfully. You can just click OK. I'm also going to convert this another file uh, for music like example. So I'm just again, just like earlier under create model, there is this import export tab, click on that one and then export MEF. So once you do that, then this is music six, music link example. So I just gave a name to this file and clicking save. So now this is also exported successfully. Once done, next stage is to now bring that file into MusicX. For that, let me open first of all my MusicX, again MusicX 1.4, which is the latest version. So I'm going to open it now. So you can see I'm now opening my MusicX 1.4 and once they are ready, I can simply bring this MEF file into MusicX. So let's wait a little bit for those files to get ready so that we can start the conversion process. All right, so this is still opening. So now you can see here, I do have this MusicX open. I'm going to close the splash screen and then now to bring those files so this is like you know your matrix is open just under file there is this new scenario uh, tab here so click on that one and click on this option here music x and your famous importer import you don't have to worry about scenario name because it will just bring the same name here whatever your mef file name is it will just uh, just give the same name to your scenario. Just what you have to do is you have to choose this M music X MEF MS importer as an option. So click OK now. 
So now, first of all, like, you know, this is a new scenario, not already associated with any project. First of all, this will try to create a new project and then only scenario. So now once you do that, it gives you an options where you can import that particular MEF file, which you just created using your music six. So now let's browse here. And then you have these files inside this one on the demo files. So this is music six example. I'm going to bring it in. So just select that file you want to import to music X, click open and click okay. So now you can see this is the one like which you are like, you know, just bringing it from your music six to music X. Also this file, you can see not only uh, have this model set of information. If you go and click on configure here, it will also uh, bring in the associated climate data set so that you don't have to worry about your climate data anymore. It is already there with that particular MEF file. Okay, click OK. It also brings other information such as in this particular wetland. If you look here, there is this storage, custom storage discharge curve. So if there is any like, you know, custom storage discharge curve, which is SQ curve associated with your certain nodes within your model, these will be also readily imported if you do it through any file import option. Also, if there are any nodes associated with different treatment devices, source nodes, it will come up. So you see in this wetland, there is some uh, node associated with this wetland. So if you right click and edit node, you can see this is the node that is associated with this particular wetland. So this is also like, you know, just uh, coming up within that MEF file information. So this is already there. You don't have to worry about bringing that in either. So let me cancel it. Also, if there are like a you know, lot of nodes or associated with different devices, there is another way of viewing it as well. It will all like you know come up here. So if you click on view nodes, you can see there are like you know various uh, nodes available for different treatment devices. So you can just like you know view all of them here based on uh, different source nodes and so on. So. This is like you know an example where I have general general climate template file, and then from music six, I just exported that as MEF and then bring it into music X. Next example, I'm going to show you with the music link. So let me again, like you know, just like earlier, I'm going to create new scenario, music x and MEF MSF importer. As you remember, I already have that MEF file with music link example. So I'm just going to click OK. And I'm bringing, so this is the one music six MLIC example, which I created earlier. I'm going to open it, click OK. So you can see this is your another example here. And if you now go and click on configure, you can see the relevant uh, music link is already attached here so you don't have to now again worry about like copying this to any music link so in this way you can see like you know you can now bring your music six files into music x uh, in a seamless way uh, for further information uh, i'd like to take you through some websites here so for further information you can go and look at this eWater web page this is confluence page for uh, online guide for music six so you can see this gives you idea of how you can export mef file within music 6.4 once you do that there is a link for importing MEF file into MusicX, you can again go through this website if you need further information. And this together, two of them will help you in the overall file conversion process. Now that we have covered the individual file conversion process, let's look at uh, the bulk exporting from Music6 files to MEF format. So you might have like uh, sometimes like you know, 100, 200 of files and you want to convert all of them together using music six to MEF format, which then you can import to music X and it is possible to do that bulk exporting. 
So please follow the link provided here. All the information is provided to you in this link on how to bulk export the data. You are also provided here with a script. Uh, you can just like, you know, download this script and follow this outline, the steps here. And this will help you to seamlessly convert your music six files into MEO format in a bulk way. And those for those all the files then will be ready for you to import in MusicX. We also have included here a simple demonstration GIF to guide you through the entire process visually. So please follow this link for bulk exporting process. Also, we uh, run regular training on music. So this is our training website, as you can see, ewater.org.au slash training. Please look at our website if you need any further training and so on. Thank you for watching. I hope this walkthrough helps you make the most of the new features in MusicX and simplifies your model conversion process. If you have any questions or need further assistance, please feel free to reach out to the eWater team.